Taipei police have told the ABC that as Alex Shorey was being medically evacuated back to Australia earlier this week, a female friend was being questioned by investigators, her residence searched and that relevant evidence was seized. Taiwan's media has gone further, saying it was rat poison found at the home of the 45-year-old woman and that she is now subject to an exit ban as the investigation continues. This is an extraordinary twist in a saga that began last month for the 24-year-old Queensland student. Alex Shorey had been in Taiwan studying for the past year. He was just a few weeks away from wrapping up and going back to Australia when he fell ill with really unusual symptoms, black spots on his skin, unusual bleeding, there was some delay in getting appropriate medical treatment, but eventually doctors say that he somehow had ingested superwarfarin, a powerful rodent killer. He responded badly to the treatment too, suffering serious organ damage. Uh, he really was in a very bad way and his friends and family had to raise around $200,000 to get a medical evacuation flight. And a few days ago, he got back to Queensland and he's now, according to his family, slowly recovering, but getting the care he needs. Mr Shorey's father has uh, declined to say anything more publicly as the investigation continues. He was initially briefed. He was over here in Taipei uh, and he did speak to police before him and his son left. Initially, there was some speculation that uh, Alex Shorey perhaps uh, ingested rat poison through local street food. Uh, then uh, there were some here in Taiwan saying uh, maybe it was illicit drugs, but police have confirmed to the ABC that neither of those avenues of investigation are being pursued uh, and that the female friend uh, is a suspect. Uh, it is an extraordinary twist and certainly uh, here in Taiwan, the media and a lot of people are now watching this case very closely.